<laughs> so I recently got a comment on one of my videos, in my last video, I believe, where a commenter asked me if I regretted stacking silver now that silver is going in the opposite direction of what we wanted to go in. And do I wish I'd done something different with my money? All right, so before we go on, I got this from a YouTube channel. They are SBS Holdings, and SBS stands for Silver Bar Stackers. The letter was so nice that I had to share it with you guys. They start off by saying, Silver Joker, your channel was the first I came across when I started stacking. Your kind, calm, and informative demeanor is what got me hooked. Your intro video features a nice, chunky 10 ounce Inglehard bar. Ever since I saw it, I've been obsessed with Inglehards. I know you generally don't like to stack too many bars, and that's why I wanted to provide you with a one ounce vintage Inglehard bar that has a similar reverse to the one featured in your video. I thought if anyone, you would appreciate this. We recently rolled out a new product called SBS Stack Packs to make vintage, collectible, and fractional silver more accessible to all. I think that's a good idea. I'm happy to present to you your custom Silver Joker pack. Thank you very much, fellas. Okay, so this pack has this in it. It has a one ounce Inglehard silver bar and they're less than 500K minted. They also include a one gram serialized Geiger silver square bar. I've collected a few. I did not even know they made one that was a one gram. That's also serialized with all the security features, which is awesome. That's an amazing gift from you guys. Thank you very much. They also included a one gram Vicambi Swiss silver bar. Now these are very popular too. You guys have all seen them. And look at this right here, a one gram generic prospect around. That's a very unique, very iconic round. And I think Inglehard makes the original ones. Also, they sent me a ton of these stickers here. Anyway, this is awesome. I appreciate this gift, you guys. I'm gonna leave a link to their channel so you can go check them out. If they're available, get you guys one of these stack packs. I'm gonna cherish mine. Thank you guys very much. Appreciate it. Also, if you like what you see and you wanna support my channel, then the best and easiest way you can do that is by simply smashing that like button. By doing so, you show YouTube that you enjoy the content that I produce. So YouTube puts my video where more people can see it. It's a small task for you, but it means so much to my channel. And if you want to see more videos like this one, simply subscribe, ring that bell, and you'll be notified as soon as I put out another video. Thank you. Hi everyone, Silver Joker here. Okay, I'm, I'm a little... I'm a little amused by that comment because to be honest, it came from a troll. I get this same commenter on a lot of my videos and he's not very nice, but I leave the comments anyway, because you know, unless they're personal, unless they're hateful, I leave them up there because everybody's entitled to their opinion. Even if it's an opinion that's just meant to elicit a certain response from me. So I'm going to address that because I think it's kind of amusing, but it's also something that I think we are struggling with. A lot of the new stackers and some of us veterans, veteran stackers are struggling with these days. And that is, is silver the right move? Was it the right move for us? And absolutely unequivocally, yes. Right now, silver is doing exactly what it's supposed to do. There's nothing different as far as I'm concerned because spot price is not, and I know I sound like a broken record, but I say this in just about every video, spot price is not the price or the value of your physical bullion. It's just simply not. You can't buy it at spot price. And if you're a savvy seller, you're not selling it at spot price. I know all of the bullion dealers that I deal with are buying silver at above spot price. And some are well above spot price. I know Phil down at Franklin Street Coin, he pays very well to get the silver into his shop. So these premiums are what they are. They are the true price of silver because we're paying them. But the value comes from you, your own personal 
belief in what silver is going to do for you is where you place your value in the silver metal. And that's just the way it is. And so do I regret stacking silver? Not even a little bit. In fact, I'm actually benefiting, I believe, because the premiums actually have ticked down some. And so now I can buy more silver, put more silver in my stack. And so it's doing exactly what it is supposed to do. It is protecting my hard earned money and it is giving me peace of mind and security for my financial health going forward. Now look, there are lots of things going on around the world. Lots of things that we need to be paying attention to, but we don't need to be afraid of any of these things because we have prepared. We have prepared our financial health for these types of situations. And not just to silver, there's a lot of other things that you need to be doing to protect your financial health. But since this is a silver stacking channel, that's what I'm focusing on. The thing is, we work hard for what we earn. We're smart with our finances and we don't depend on anything but our own effort, our own hard work to accomplish the things that we want to accomplish. And you want to protect all the effort that you put into building something for the future. And you need to do that by getting something that's outside of the influence of all the craziness that's going on around us. Silver, physical silver, physical gold, and some of the other precious metals have been around for a long time. They've been valuable for a long time. People have sought after them and desired them for a long time. They have protected people's finances and their wealth for a long time. And we are gambling that this is going to be true going forward. If you stack silver 10 years ago, 20 years ago, you're re reaping the benefits from that right now. So by us stacking silver now, me, I've been stacking silver. Eventually when I'm ready to take advantage of what silver is going to do for me, it will benefit me. But will silver make me rich? Well, maybe or maybe not, but that's not why I'm stacking it. I'm stacking it now because I know that it's going to give me access to the things I need when I need them. I cannot make that same comment about fiat currency. So do we really believe that we are so insulated that we don't have to worry about these things? Well, maybe, but if you do have to worry about these things, it's better to have and not need than to need and not have. And so anyway, short video. Right now, silver is more affordable than it was a few months ago. So stack it, buy the dip if you can. Don't hurt yourself financially. I am not giving you financial advice. I'm only telling you what I'm doing for my financial future. You do your own research. You know, silver is that metal. All right, so what you're seeing here is some of my favorite pieces from the US Mint. Now, there's not a whole lot of US Mint products that feature people like me. They're getting a lot better at it, but I've had some people over to my house recently. And if you're like me, you do not let the opportunity to cart out some of your favorite pieces pass you by. So that's what I did. Uh, and this is what I hope for. I hope for the golden question. I hope somebody's gonna ask me, how can I get these pieces of silver and how is this gonna benefit me? That to me is a golden question. If somebody asked me that, buddy, that's like hitting a lotto for me. That gives me the opportunity to really express some things that I'm passionate about and I love that. So anyway, if you're stacking silver and you've decided that stacking silver is right for you, you're doing the right thing as far as I'm concerned. This is my personal opinion. Anyway, I got a, another video of conversation that I had with Silver 5150. I think you guys are gonna really enjoy that. That's posted already. So if you haven't seen that yet, go check that out. And, uh, you know, we're just going to keep the silver train rolling. Appreciate you guys stopping by. Keep stacking. Peace.